Hi, this is Paul from paulbrabby.com and this is a vlog for the Expert Algo. This is on copper, a couple of trades in the same afternoon. I want to go through, tell the story, especially around the support and resistance zones. Okay, so we get a six star buy here yesterday on the 9th of November at 1 p.m. Um, European time. So coming into the pre-market, early pre-market US. We don't go long into resistance, okay? We then form this double top, really, really great looking double top here. We can see here this is pretty pretty much spot on. Just put that horizontal array here. We are very, very close, within 3% double top there. Usually a double top you would go low, short below this pivot, but obviously we wait for a signal. We get a six, cells, a six star sell signal on this three minute this is a signal candle here we're already below this pivot entry for the double top so we go short below the low of this signal candle the stop is just above the pivot before the signal candle risk to reward all the way down to this next uh, zone is huge okay massive even to this pivot point here we're one to one so great looking trade came down very very good once you with this high can actually once you get more than two or three green candles against that to a bearish move the time is really to to get out you can use these pivots as well as trailing stops uh, then we go sideways for a little bit then we get another six star sell later on that evening okay very very simple uh, we've got still got loads of risk to reward uh, if we go stop just above the pivot for the signal candle here we enter just below the signal candle uh, really really tight stop and entry we're not risking as much as we would on that previous trade so we go down we're one to one to this pivot here so for me that's a nice little scalp trade there comes down we get a pivot we bounce off now later on we do get another six star signal but we got a rejection at this pivot point here we've had two good trades you've got to be talking to yourself now saying this is enough if i'm going to go short it's got to break this pivot here which it didn't and it's gone so it's about understanding how that behavior is uh, as well so we, we reject it here we get another six star style don't get excited say to yourself okay we've got a rejection here the the entry has to be below this pivot for this third trade of that afternoon so very very simple setups there get them it gets the printed you've got to look you've got to have your support resistance zones on uh, you've got to look at previous pivots uh, and you've got to make sure you've got a decent risk reward into those pivots um, for those trades so hopefully that helps again I'll just keep doing these uh, and over and over again just so you can use them for learning